you guys, I'm here at the Antiquarium Bookmark here on Broadway Street and I'm gonna go ahead and check out some books. So let's go inside. Hi, so this is uh, Bobby Wright over here and he is the owner of the bookstore and over here there's all uh, used books and there's a huge selections that you can choose from and he's gonna go ahead and explain a little bit about the history. My father started it after retiring from the Army here in 1971. Wow. So we'll be celebrating our 50th anniversary next year. Uh, I've been here myself since 1975. I graduated from college and couldn't find a job in my chosen field at that time. And my father had said uh, I could clerk the store until I determined what it was that I wanted to do. And I've been here ever since, and I really do love it. As you can see, I've been buying books like they're going out of style. I keep, so I keep putting them out. And business has been very good. Uh, people continue to read, thankfully, although I'm doing a large majority of my business on the internet now. Oh, okay. I started selling on the internet in 2005, and uh, uh, it's amazing to me uh, how many more books I've been selling because of it. When we first opened, uh, we bought the building, there was already a tenant in our sharing our building. It was an antique store called Land of Wars Antiques. and. Uh, they were here for about 15 or 20 years before they left, and then we expanded over to that side. So, when when uh, back in the old days, uh, when you came in here, this place you could hardly even walk around. There were so many books. But when they left, we, we were able to move more bookshelves over there. So therefore, you yeah. can kind of breathe in here now. Yeah, you know. I love the the feel and the the, the vibe. Of course, walk it, right in yeah, here. Sure, I understand that. It's like a That's little my... hidden gym bookstore. <laughs> well, there's so much character inside here. Well, it's been my yeah. life, and there's a lot of my icons on the walls. Yeah. You know, all of my all of my heroes. So, if you like any Western or Americana books, they have some right here. Nice. Tons of Texas in the West books. Look at this. Look at this cover. Look how great this is. Oh my gosh. I can spend hours and hours just reading books here. Okay, so if you love literature, here's your section. So many literature books right here. My goodness. They have medieval and middle age books right here. There's games about chess and just so many books. Wow, oh my gosh, this place is huge. There's so many books. This is a hidden area. I mean, everything's hidden. Once you walk in here, it's like a maze here. They have art books right here. So many different art books. I mean, come on, look at the selection. And if you love photography books, they have them. They have architecture books, books about movies, if you like anything about movies, production, sports books, crafts, they have everything. Now right over here, there's more books about military history, so if you love to read up on that, definitely this is your area. I mean, come on, you can just sit down, grab a book, and read about the whirlwind of the war of war. I can just sit here for hours and read. But, okay, I still gotta show you the bookstore. <laughs> okay, so here are all your paperback books, the soft cover books, and if you are a mystery lover, they have tons of mystery books right here. These are actually hardback books right here, but here are some of the soft cover books right here. Tons of literature books here. I mean, this is just amazing. I mean, there's just so many books. If you want to learn about China, Japan. Okay, guys, so if you like science fiction, this is your area. I mean, there's tons and tons of books right here. And there's also general fiction here. I think I'm more into the general fiction, so I'm just going to... Oh wait, this is interesting. Flirting in Spanish. If you want to know how to flirt in Spanish, this is your book. Hmm. I'm gonna grab another book. The Moon and the Mango Tree. Nice. 